Hey guys, welcome back to the fourth tutorial of learning Python playlist. In this tutorial, I'll be explaining you about variables. Variable is something which just holds a value in it, either it be a string or a teacher value or float, anything, any value. Variable is just used to hold any particular value in it. So what I mean to say is if I wanted to hold an integer value, I'll just define my variable my well is anything so in this case this this variable which is named as my variable will be holding an integer value because i just assigned an integer value to it right so i can even store any string value to any variable uh, like my variable to x no or inserting a string value as i told you in my string uh, video that we use single quotes or double quotes so hi uh, so in this case this variable my variable 2 would be holding a string value you can even you can even store multiple values in a single variable but remember the value which would be finally stored in the variable would be the one which was inserted at last what i mean to say is in this case this variable my variable this thing is holding an integer value so what if i just insert a string in it okay something something and in this case when i print out this value this should show me the last inserted value which was this string so if i print this see it's just showing me the string value which was inserted at last so it was updated after this line when i use this variable to store a string value in it so you can even check the value you know type data type we have an inbuilt function that's called type and if i check this my variable and if I simply print this, this, this function, this type function basically takes the data type and returns it as a string. So if I just print it out, print this, sorry, just delete a type. This statement, this particular statement would just print out the data type of the variable my variable right uh, if i just run it see it's showing the int as this variable had 13 stored in it earlier but after the after this statement if i try to get the type of this my variable output could be different see after this it's holding a string value and when i finally print this out in uh, as you can see in this statement it just is telling me the last inserted value in that variable which was inserted in that variable so this was regarding the variables basics of variables also i would like to tell you about another function uh, which is input function so this function is basically you know in this method this method basically reads a line from input as the name says it basically reads a line from input converts into a string and returns this method is useful when you wanted end user to you know prompt out something like suppose if you wanted to ask something uh -huh. uh, what's your name this is a question and you are expecting some answer to it so in this case this would prompt you know uh, let me run it first see it's it just printing out hi what's your name and it's expecting some you know value so if i type sunesh chadri this would be 
and this further the value as I told you that this function returns a string value so I can basically store this into a variable let's say the name of uh, my variable was name and this function this method would be returning me a string value which the end user typed right so if I print this out print name let me remove and run it again first it's asking me the name Sunesh Hari and if I hit enter it would just print out the variable right now suppose I wanted to ask an age input works your age and in this case I'm expecting end user to enter integer value and I print this out age in this case I say let's say 25 I hit enter this would print out my age but as I told you that this input method would be returning me string value I definitely entered 25 which seems to be an integer but this would be converted to a string and then returned back what I mean we can even verify with the type function which I discussed earlier if I just want to know the type of this returned variable I'll just write this and just print it out it will be showing me string let's see uh, first let me insert any integer value 25 so here again as I can see it's a string I think you understood what I wanted to tell you so it's time for a quick exercise what I want you guys to do is you know write a small piece of code uh, in which you would be asking the end user the year of their birth and after you get the value you need to calculate their current age so I want you guys to you know pause this video for a while uh, write that code in your code editor and get back once once you are done so let's start with the code uh, so I'll ask the end user to enter their year of birth what is your uh, year something and I expect the, uh, a value from them. Now I can store this value in some variable this way. When I get this age, I want to calculate. Now this is year of birth. Year of birth year, let's say. Birth year. Now, now once I get this birth year, I want to calculate the age. So what I can do is age equals uh, birth year uh, the current year which is 2019 minus birth year and finally printing it out age so what do you think this would work let's see What is your birth year? Let's say 1994 and hit enter. Oops, there is an error. And what's that? It says unsupported open type for int and string. What it wants to say is, you know, this expression, this this very expression can't be evaluated because the two operands are of different types. One is string and the other one is integer why is this a string because I told you whenever you use an input function it would return me a string even if you enter integer value it would convert it into a string and then it would be returning me so what I can do in this case is we have different functions to convert from integer to string or string to integer or float to string 
So basically have function, predefined functions in Python, which can convert a string value to an integer. Function is int, simply int. So this string value, birth year, the variable birth year, would be converted to integer using this int function, right? Now, when I run this, let's see. I enter the uh, this year birth year. I say 1994. Hit enter, and it just calculates the value. Now there was no error because uh, the, both the operands. This was integer, and this, as you can see, is integer. Are of same data type, and it could easily convert. Now what if I just wanted to write, you know, hey, your age is this uh, and this plus operator is used to concatenate two strings now in this case this particular thing is a string i know but this is an integer if you are not sure let me tell you the type age and i just print it out and uh, just comment this for a while and just print it out. This is integer. This variable is holding an integer value, right? Now, I simply wanted to print hi, your age is this and this. Now, as I told you, this plus operator here works as a concatenation operator. It basically concatenates two strings. This is a string, we know it, but this is not a string. So what I'll do is I'll convert this thing to a string first uh, using the function str and now let's run it. What's your birth year? It says 9992. Hi, your age is 25. As simple as that so this was it for this video uh, we'll meet in the next video till then be masked and keep rocking